Hello guys and welcome to Overpass. We are back with a brand new episode. And yes, we're actually quite close. So it says 11 out of 12. Does that open up this? I'm intrigued. Very intrigued. Is that like the finale? I don't know. Anyway, uh, Coastal Competition. Uh, we get 10,000 for this. It is an obstacle course and then also uphill. Really tempted by the ATVs, but... No, we stick with UTVs for now. I do I do love my little Red Bull. I mean, it's got such a good stats. So, yeah, we stick with that for now. And that's a little bit repetitive, but we want to get it done. We want to win these competitions. We want max points. So the goal, the goal is to get the gold. <laughs> Six minutes, 45 seconds. Should I do more videos on this game? I do want to try and get to that sort of finale and then maybe do that. So we'll see what happens. Um, yeah, let me know. Should I do more? Should we stop it here? I am all about the feedback. So leave your likes, your comments, suggestions in the comments, please. <laughs> Great intro, Scott. Great intro. I should completely redo that. But I'm not. I'm going to keep on going. That was a shocking intro. Let's get this done. Let's do it. Let's get it done, baby. It's still got that screen tearing, isn't it? But that's still an issue. It's mad. Absolutely bonkers. Ooh, there we go. That was smooth. Over these rocks, I guess. You know, we're going the right way. I actually forgot to look at the, um, the mileage. That's normally quite a good sort of um, scale power to dip difficult it's going to be, based on the time. Oh. Still that, still that screen tearing. I was hoping, I've not played the game for a while now, I was sort of hoping that would be fixed. Uh, it's still extremely apparent that's there. Very much there. Uh, over these rocks again. Yep. Check out. Oh god. I can decide there. Just went straight into it. Oh, cannot blame the game whatsoever there. Stupid, stupid scuffs. Took on some damage as well. Mistakes happened. This actually isn't too bad this course so far. So far, touch wood. Made a few mistakes. Could definitely be a bit more aggressive actually. Break! Could try to get through there. Perfect. Jeez, the speed really gets going now. It's, it's a very quick UTV. Very quick. Remember, it's only one lap. As long as I've got my, my trigger set to shoot. So when I break it, it happens immediately. Which isn't too bad, but... I wonder if the goal is on the cards here. Let's see. Again, it would be nice to have a percentage. It would be nice to know where I am on the track. Just some sort of hint. <laughs> it's all just complete guesswork. Until obviously you get this little course and you've done it again, like several times. Then you can get it locked into your brain. You know what's going on. You know what corner's coming up, that sort of stuff. Get in bump it! Puddles here and there from the sea. It's fairly out at the moment. If we hit that tape, that can cause us a few issues. Actually, someone gave me a pretty good tip for the last episode is basically don't stop accelerating. If you stop accelerating, you're screwed basically. So always have some sort of power. Of course you can moderate the power, but always have some sort of power. Otherwise you're getting stuck, basically. Who put these barrels here? You hooligans! Tip through that. Really? I hit through that? I think it's fair. It's a pretty fun little course, actually. I do prefer these sort of courses that are not too, too crazy. Go, 
go, go, go, go. Well, the pace is a bit higher. Pretty fun. Whoa. Yeah, I, I thought, I'm actually not done a video on this game for a while, so I'm not really sure what the response is going to be like. I did see that we were quite close to that finale, so... Maybe we should try and get to that point. Because that might be the sort of end of the game, I guess. End of the film. Obviously, there'll be more events to do. But in terms of the actual sort of progression, that might be it. Let's keep that power going. Woo! This is a big drop. Whoa! Let it roll. Oh! Should slow down just a little bit more. A bit more there. <laughs> uh, this way. So that's I stopped using the power briefly. Wasn't quite sure where to go, and then this happens. There we go. Just trying to avoid the penalty, and then yeah, that happened. Come on. All the power or no power? Definitely no power. Like, I mean, all the power. Oops. Jeremy Clarkson. All power. I'm all about the power. Left. So in terms of getting a gold, 6 minutes 45 seconds. Again, I don't really have any idea where the finish line's going to be. It feels like it's been a fairly good run. Uh, Boats have been like, overly aggressive. Who left these boats here? Don't roll it. Turn left here. Bump here, bump here. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. And yes, we have taken on a little bit of damage. So we have about a minute left now, guys, to get that gold. No pressure. Oh, what's this? something. Right. Just about get up it. There we go. Lost a lot of time there though. Some valuable seconds. Where is the finish line? It's there. We've got a gold. Yeah, we did it. Celebration. Whoa. 7 minutes 22. Second place. We smashed the opponents into tiny bits. Um, That is a lot of money. But yeah, fix it. Fix it up. I was really enjoying the first event. I was actually, I was, like, I was like, wow, we should have played this game more. I was really loving it. And then this event appeared. It's really weird. The car, the vehicle just doesn't have any grip. And when I look at the tires, I'm like, how do you help have any grip? This vehicle is built off-road. One job in mind, off-road. That's all it's got to do, is be good off-road. But it consistently, consistently gets stuck all the time. It doesn't know what it wants, whether it doesn't want any power, does it want steady power? Come on, please. It's just a bit of dust. I mean, look, that's not even that high. I'm sorry, if that was a real... If, 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 if this vehicle... I can't see probably. If this vehicle was real, it would rip up that, that hill. Like, it would rip up it in seconds. I'm not even kidding, man. Oh my god. Come on. See it? Stuck here briefly. Let's do this bit again. It's going a little bit too crazy with the, uh, the old acceleration. Take it steady. There we go. Oh my god. The stress. There's not a chance in hell, by the way, I'm getting a gold on this because this next slope is even worse. Let's get past these rocks. Let's get another checkpoint, so that's good. What happened there is I briefly lost two wheels. Two wheels went up in the air, and the big was that night. We ain't going up anymore, mate. Sorry. 
I don't want to go on that wood, that wooden plank. Is that what a vehicle wants? Because I'm trying to do that, but apparently there's no grip on these rocks. If these tyres were real, this is real life, it would grip onto these rocks and move so quickly up this slope. It would be gone in seconds. It would be done in seconds. Sometimes games take it to the, the realism a little bit too far, I think, personally. There's no way I'm getting up there. I'm just going to have to keep doing this until I do it, because there's nothing more I can do. Right. That, that rocks far, man. What was it wrong for me? <sighs> there goes my gold. There goes my perfectly good first event. Cheers, game. What do I do now? Just to reverse a little bit. There we go. That might be that silver. Yeah, silver. Sixth place, you kidding me? Oh, Jesus. So unfortunately I went down to second place. Equal second place. Great. Cheers, game. <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> oh Jesus. I was gonna do another event, but I don't want my stress levels to go too high. Stress at the moment. So I might have to leave it for now. That's the guy in first place as well that just beat me because of that stupid last level. It is annoying because once I do get the power down correctly sometimes, it does seem to work. But I try all that at different scenarios and it doesn't work. So I'm trying to use the power. I'm trying to experiment and stuff here and there, but it just doesn't work. Whew, right. I've been awarded 8,050 rep. Nice, thank you. We can buy the Arctic Cat, Arctic Cat, Wild Cat, <laughs> what a name. Um, do we have that already? Is it worth buying 12,000? Yeah, go for it. Pretty sure I already own it, but. This is an underground event. Yes, it's tempting, but I'm more focused on the main stuff right now. I was gonna try this event, um, but I tried to get up the first hill in an ATV and it didn't even go up it, <laughs> despite trying several times, trying different vehicles. I was going to try and do another event, but um, yeah, it, it sort of failed. I went up the, the first slope, obviously it's a, a hill climb, and it just would not go up it. So yeah, we ended there. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you guys want to do more overpass, if you enjoy me getting stressed out, um, let me know. I do re-out the game, but there's just a few things I'm like, this is an off-road vehicle. Surely there's more grip available. Surely we can go up this hill. It doesn't have to be this hard. That's how I feel sometimes. I don't know. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and bye-byes.